Mike McNamara, Strategic Buyers Agents here on Cows, Phillip Island, uh, the playground for the Bass Coast. We're here looking at properties for clients and we're looking at uh, both uh, real cows and over on the other side towards Ventnor. Property prices in cows and Phillip Island generally went up incredibly last year like all regional areas and we've bought in quite a few of them last year. They say the figure was perhaps even 25-26% for cows, this town here. A town of about five to 6,000 people on a permanent residence, but of course in summer it goes way through, way much higher than that. Behind me is the, towards the um, Silverleaves estate, which is probably the most expensive area of cows. As you're looking out to the water, to my right here, uh, Silverleaves is on that side. And uh, behind the, where I'm looking here, to my other side, you've got the Red Rocks Estate going down that way, which is, uh, has lovely beaches, but is a bit further out of cows. And looking up, up Thompson's Avenue, the main strip of the island, of cows itself, a long strip with all the fun things, the, the fooderies, the eateries, um, it's central cows and probably the most expensive property prices. If you wanted to buy property in, in cows, prices have now evened off, steadied off according to the agents I've been talking to, and the hike in property prices we saw last year is no longer happening. The prices, prices are still elevated of course, but they're in demand. If you want to buy property on the Bass Coast, or on Phillip Island in particular, or even cows in particular, get in touch and we can help you out. Mike McNamara from Strategic Buyers Agents, here in lovely sunny cows.